stomach churns around and around. The bile within is unsettled. Each moment brings a new surge. Your companions sleep like blissful lumps of meat. The gods fight over her. But is she truly that special? You could do so much better, my lord. I am here to watch your moment of triumph, my loathly master. Your clever mind is penning tragedy as we speak. Your repressed urge yearns to kill. And kill you will. Tonight, the moment you close your eyes, your favorite person will be brutalized. Then it should be a trifling matter to kill this one. Ah, she was starting to trust you, the only one she ever has. Pity it's coming to an end. It is my duty to ensure you are making the right decisions, Master. There was much uh, disappointment at your reluctance to kill the little moon maiden. You could kill this one deliberately. I'm sure it will be considered a great show of goodwill. The tithe could still be yours. I do not doubt you will act with a decorum befitting one of your rank. A good night, sweet lord. Your companion rests blissfully, without a fear in the world. As your hand approaches her body, it wavers. It longs to close around her throat. As your hand approaches her body, it wavers. Alright, gotta wake her up. It longs to close around her throat. Just. Yes. Hmm. Oh. Has the mood struck you, love? I suppose we could try. If you think the others won't stir. Hold on. You look like you've had a shock. Something the matter? You're in a lot of danger. We need to act fast. All right. I'm awake. Tell me everything. As you tell your story, fatigue fills your body. Your head swims with the worst headache you've known. The beast that killed Alfira will call again. My, my, my possessed mind will kill you. Hells. What I wouldn't give for a boring lover sometimes. <laughs> oh, wow. Do I even want to know the answer to that? Brother, you trusted me sooner. You're given one to talk. Suddenly, Alfira's death makes a lot more sense. 
We're going to figure this out, understand? We have to. Suddenly you become drowsy. Your vision blurs and floods with yellow bile. And you faint in a dizzy blur. You are not yourself. All control is gone. You convinced me to spare Night Song. You and I are both capable of resisting the darkness that compels us. <laughs> I wish nothing more than cut you up and eat you raw. If you've energy to flirt, you've energy to fight this thing. Stay with me. I know you can. Your hands are raw and bloody as every inkling of your urge yearns you to tear your bindings. Easy. You're in control. Bloodlust won't win tonight. Try to express gratitude. Ah, no. Oh, look at that. Yay. You can thank me once the bloodlust subsides. Keep Damn. Fast. The night passes sick and sweating, but bloodlessly. You once again inhabit your own mind. Are you back to yourself? Hells, Alfira didn't stand a chance. I think some more explaining is in order. <laughs> exactly what just came over you? Uh. Recount your urges holding your past life responsible. That person's a stranger to me. Don't torment yourself with the past. I'll help protect you. I promise. Seems I'll need to just to keep myself safe. Mm. I have killed so many people. You should end me here and now. Well, it's always an option if we're out of <laughs> ideas. But let's at least try to save you before it comes to that. Hmm? We'll best this. Just think positively. Or at least don't think murderously. Besides, there's plenty of foes out there for you to vent your impulses on. Hey, Lazel. I'm surprised you didn't wake up. You were worried about this killing lurch. I can see it. I will try to help you resist. But spill a single drop of my blood, and yours will flow in a gusher. Asterion. Need something? You have no opinions? Oh, yeah, that reminds me. You're staying here. Need something? Oh, darling, I'm... Uh, it sounds... <sighs> I think I'm gonna have to take... I think I'm gonna take Gale with us. Glad to see we all made it through the night intact. A promising sign that we may be able to curb those urges of yours. Now, as the saying goes, what's left undone should be left unspoken. Is there some lighter subject you wish to discuss? Join me. With... What am I gonna? I think I'm gonna have Shadowheart, uh, Shadowheart, Carlac, and Are you sure maybe Gale or Jahira. But I think I'm gonna pick Gale. Hey, Will. I don't even consider Will an option anymore. I've witnessed countless cruelties, faced unimaginable evil. But Thorn, he is made of pure hate. The Sword Coast will rejoice. My father is somewhere in this tower. I won't leave him in Thorn's hands. And lest we forget, we've a devil to rescue. Two missions, one destination. 
You have any opinions on the Dark Urge? I see the hunger. It worries me too. Ah, uh, whoops. But you are stronger than the hunger. You can resist. You will resist. I'm sure of it. Hey, Carlac. About what happened? About your affliction? I know you're sorry. And I know you're probably afraid it'll happen again. I'll look after myself. You look after you. If we each do our part, we'll both be all right. Come on, we're heading out. Yes. <laughs> You're going to be excited to kill Ketherick Thorn, aren't you? I know you have your personal demons to contend with. But if I didn't make it clear before, I think you can beat this. Just don't give in. And seek help if you need it. You wanted something? I'm gonna sit right here. Yes. You sit right there and let me drink in the sight of you. <laughs> Aw. Alright, leave camp. I hope long resting didn't ruin everything. Anything. All right, we're off to attack Moonrise Towers. Ugh, the rendering. I am certain this is a PS5 issue and not a PC issue. Ah! Oh. Ooh, looks like a whole bunch of dead bodies already. Hey, Jahira. What's up? Hello? Oh, there we go. I'm shackled from shadows. She will rise in moonlit glory and carve a path of brightness to the accursed one's second death. So saith the wise Alondo. That beacon of angelic wrath has taken the fight to Catherick on the rooftop. In the first line of defense, are dead. But storming the tower won't be easy. And if we wait too long, Catherick will gather his strength and retaliate. So, let's go get him. For now, though, he's on the back foot for the first time since he returned from the grave. This is it. The spearhead moment. You brought us this far. So how shall we proceed? Charge! I reap every soul. A sound strategy. Once it's done, me and my harpers will hold the ground floor while you hunt down the general himself. Floric left some of her flaming fist. They'll scout the prisons and the barracks below to ensure we're not taken by surprise. Say the word, and we're off. All right, let's do this. At the ready, Harpers! In this light, there will be victory. In this light, we will avenge the fallen! <laughs> the time has come. Gatherick will taste of death at last. <laughs> like the... An, again, you mean. Of your flesh, what are you waiting for? 
Let's just get this ready. Fireball. Behold the dance of death. They're already weakened up. Hey, Jahira. Hello. As long as we hold this floor, the tower is ours. I'll stay here. Ensure no one comes up or down without a scimitar welcome. You're close now. A final audience with Ketherick Thorm awaits. Yep, he's gonna be excited. Ha! <laughs> Keen eye. I suppose I could be persuaded. Mm. Fair enough. Then be persuaded. The time has come. Gather equal taste of death at last. Yes. I hope this. I hope this doesn't screw us over. Yeah, you're kind of fucked now, dude. You. What have you done? What have you done to me? <laughs> you're mortal again, Thorm. I've come to finish you. Impossible. You are a thrall. A slave. You serve the absolute. You serve me. Oh, we pissed him off. <laughs> Bow, you dog. Bow! Uno reverse. <laughs> and he knows we have the weapon now. The prism. You've had it all this time, you worm. You will bow before me. And if you will not bow, you will break. You. <laughs> How good it is to see you again, Ketterick. At last, you found a godmaster that suits you, it seems. Halen. The thief. You stole Isabel from me, and now you think you'll take my life in the bargain? You dare to speak her name? After your crimes innumerable, you would evoke her before me! Enough. This ends here and now, at last. He will crumble at the power of your touch. Give him all you have. Yeah, let's beat him. Let's beat this old man up. Or not. He's going to knock Aelin down again. Enough. My lord beckons me. You must return to your prison, and my daughter must be reclaimed. Your daughter? Isabel. Yeah, that's a dirty trick. Tentacle was colossal. 
Oh, don't bullshit me. We need to find out where it took Catherick. Right to do the trick. Uh, dark ones on luck. Ring of Exalted Merit. I guess I'll get the general will call that a tactical retreat, I'm sure. But you have him on the run. That thing he summoned was illicit. Yeah, what below, made you think that? Find him before he has a chance to subdue the night song again. You and your harpers aren't coming? Better they stay here, and hold the tower should Ketherick's army catch wind of our assault. But if you have room for one lone soldier, I would face Ketherick by your side. Uh... Sorry. As you wish. Good hunting. I mean, unless you could... Ketherick awaits. You have numbers enough already, I think. I'll be waiting. Uh, I was hoping you would join me. You peer down the hole. Here we go. The hole yawns back at you, impossibly wide. A single tentacle burrowed through stone. Let us jump. <laughs> this is an illicit colony. This must be where they harvest the tadpoles. We're close to the source of the infections. All of this sitting beneath moonrise. For how long? And how deep does it go? Yeah. The membrane. Tread carefully. We are very close to the source of the absolute now. That telepathic storm has become a tempest. Ugh. Whoa. Huh. Give it a shot. Wait, wait, I don't want to open it. No, no touch. It is wrong. Other. You're right, it is other, so let me take it away. All right, buddy. You sing wrong song too. In wrong voice. Sing other song together then. But uh. away from here. Hey there, buddy. It's us! Oh. But heroes <laughs> remain near and far. Better to stay together. You and us, we... We will remain with you. Call us, and we will be at your side. Ooh. Okay, if you guys don't remember, uh, the brain you could interact with on the on the ship I'm pretty sure that's the same brain we released on the ship Lashes Balthazar 
not let one of his walking carcasses lapse from his control. Let's ferry them back. Wait! By the bone lord. It's you! Uh... I thought I'd never see you again. I wanted to keep you for myself. But they shipped you away. Uh... Who was I to you when I was here before I was infected? You talk! And you are aware. How is that possible? Oh, but what an arresting voice you have. Uh... You're not supposed to be here, special one. That's not right. But I don't want to damage you. You were my very first, after all. Yo! I learned everything about the parasites from you. I remember finding you close to death. Beaten black and blue on the floor of this sanctum. It must have been a few hours after the tadpole was placed in your skull. How you got here was a total mystery. But I stitched you up just enough to keep you alive. Then placed you within your crib. I kept you as mine. Until you were needed by our superiors. We had such a close bond. I opened you up endlessly with my skulls. And got lost in your insides. Yeah, a okay, you shadow heart's face. I think she's jealous. <laughs> uh, this is where I was left after someone infected me? I was not behind it. I do not know. But whoever did it, I'm so glad they left you here for me. Truthfully, I'm not surprised to see you found your way back here all by yourself. I always knew you were clever. It has never been the same with another. All the other victims who come here just meekly obey. You thrashed. You fought. You were in Well, at least I didn't take it down. <laughs> take it but sitting down. As special as you are. You shouldn't be swanning around here, acting as if free will is yours again. We're going to kill you, sweet one. Ah. I promise I will stay with you afterwards. Come on. Lashes. Bring this one back to my table and prepare my knives for a long night of experiments. Uh oh. Did Shovel just say fisting time? Oh my god. Okay, what does this do? Okay, consume a creature's mind if it's intelligent. I don't want to risk us being killed. Okay, that's going to get confusing. Man, how dare they fireball us? That's our thing. Carlac, do it. I don't know why you weren't. Say bye bye. Shield. I'm going to say, what's the meaning of this? Oh, Gail's not having a fun time. 
Let's say, how dare they fireball us? you together after whatever caused your head to get in this mess someone else must have attacked you in the hmm. midst of whatever you were doing down here this necromancer was a grunt in the scheme of the horrors enacted against you that attacker is the source <laughs> it's your face uh Let's try to remember the attack. In the heart of all these membranes, there was a dagger awaiting you all along. But from who? Feeling fresh? Oh, never mind. This is where the prisoners are. But empty of tadpoles. Is that unusual inside? Harvesting all the larvae indicate by Grazit's cock. It's about time you came. <laughs> you got caught. <laughs> what have we here? Hold on, I need to relish the moment. Go on and gloat. Bow to your pretend crowd. <laughs> well done. Good. Now enough sniffing around and get me out of this thing. Um uh, Say you know a pa mm. Do I want Will to lose his contract? Try to go with history. The reason I say that is if Will keeps his contract, I'm pretty sure Mazora will join us in the fight later. Uh, performance, I guess. Say you know a path breaking charm. I'll be damned. You want to free the pup from his pact. And you thought that idiotic display would do it. <laughs> Play your game. But I amend the path. Clause F, section 9. Soulbinder shall bestow reward or favor only upon soul bearers' fulfillment of related obligation. Okay. You of this provision, better known as the You First clause. Now, open the pod. Your eyes turn to the control panel next to the pod. It has two devices marked with a lithid symbols. The controls are open to your tadpole's command. To your authority. Respect my authority. <laughs> Gather your strength and smash your foot. Yeah, that one presser. Good work. 
I'd give you a gold star, but I'm fresh out. As for the pact... <coughs> Clause Z, Section 13. If the Soulbinder consents to separation, she will release the Soul Bearer from all obligation within six months. Okay. Oh, six months is a trifle. You barely read through a single bookcase in Candlekeep in such a time. Ignorant thing. It's always the terms and conditions that get you. Eh, shrug. Six months isn't that long of a wait. Right. I'm out of here. I need a long bath. I'll leave you to your very serious business. But don't you fret. If you survive this place, I'll find you. The pup will be needing me. Count on it. Oh, and ask Will how we met. I've loosened his tongue. It's real cracker of a tale. <laughs> Ta-ta. Okay. How do you guys feel? This place is an illicit stronghold. Let's finish what we came here to do. Shut our heart. You'd think I'd have more sympathy for someone trapped in a pod, <laughs> but perhaps we should have left Mazura where we found her. Yeah, Will would have been screwed, though. You wanted something. How are you feeling? Do you really need to ask? Uh. I'm sorry. I have a lot on my mind. The shadow fell. Night song. I can think of little else. I need you to stay focused. I know. It's just hard to look past this. I feel like a huge part of me is missing. And worse still, I feel I cut it out. The sooner I speak to Night Song, the sooner I'll know. Are there conversations in and early? Or is it just me? Assuming I have a future at all. I'm here for you if you need me. Thank you. I'm not entirely sure that was a wise decision. Better the devil you know, I suppose. The one Will knows, at least. Well, Will, I mean, yeah, Will would get, would have got fucked if we didn't do anything. Oh. Mind flayers and civilians. Side by side. 